Watching those clips seriously brought me back to Jaipur. It is crazy. I had such an amazing time. I went to Jaipur on my second week there in India and um, a few months before I left I had booked a reservation with an elephant farm called Elephantastic and they provide ethical, safe, chain-free, abuse-free experiences for people to get up close and personal with these elephants in such a humane way. Uh, they assigned me an elephant. Her name was Kolfi and she was super friendly, 19 years old. So beautiful, these creatures. Oh my gosh. Uh, she looked like a dinosaur in real life. It was just so intimidating. From New Delhi, I took a bus from uh, Central Delhi and all the way down to Jaipur it was seven hours which was not too bad actually really honestly not too bad just make sure you have some water and snacks and yeah I went with two girls two IVHQ volunteers who want to go to Jaipur also 
we had left around 2 p.m. I think and then got there around 9 so we got to the bus station in Jaipur we split I split from them because they went ahead and did their own thing I already had booked everything way in advance I had an Airbnb which also was amazing like the place I stayed in was incredible that room was like jaw-dropping but in the morning I had a driver from the Elephantastic farm pick me up we went over I spent the whole day there and then at sunset my driver was like do you want to go to the monkey temple and I was these are one of the moments where you are telling yourself um i probably shouldn't do this and then another part of you is like you're in india you should go to this monkey temple so i was like yes let's go and so we did we got to the monkey temple and we came across some people you know who are just standing around wanting to tour for tips and so i went ahead and went with one of the guys that i met down there and he brought me up to the top. We talked and we walked up. We fed the monkeys, took pictures, watched the sunset over Jaipur and it was incredible. Like this place was so picturesque and insanely beautiful. But I cannot wait to go back to Jaipur. My experience there was a hundred percent. It was everything I imagined it would be. I feel so lucky to have experience even just like a tiny little speck of the state of Rajasthan it's just one of those dream places that I have always wanted to go to ever since I had planned my India trip which was around two years back so if you haven't checked out yet I already posted one video of my first week in India traveling through Delhi and then ending in Agra at the Taj Mahal that was an insane experience but yeah i have one more video to post from my trip and that would be going up to rishikesh but i really want to end it here by saying thank you for watching and please subscribe for more adventures we have so many amazing things coming up but thank you so much for following my journey and i'll see you guys next time